All right, we have yet another 2020 NASCAR diecast haul. We have nine 164s, one 164. Empty them out, and one 124. As you guys saw from the thumbnail. Where should we start? Um, let's go ahead. Arca car, Haley Deegan, number four. Oh, that's pretty cool. Nice. We'll go ahead. We'll actually go ahead and unbox it. Let's get this popped open. This is my first Arca car I've ever gotten. Okay. Using the Ford Fusion body. There we have it. Toter. Is that an elephant on the side? Wait, what? It almost looks like an elephant or a gorilla, but I don't think it's an animal. Number four. Toter built for extremes. General tire. Menards Ford Fusion. Haley Deegan. Pretty cool car. And we'll move on if I can find the rest of the trash. Um, uh, okay, here it is. All right, car number two will go to the Xfinity Series. I didn't get any trucks. Noah Gregson, number nine NASCAR Authentics car. So let's go ahead and get this one open. Here we go. Pretty clean car. They had three Noah Gregsons. I don't see any chips. Oh, there's a chip on that number nine. Is that supposed to be there? No, no never mind. It's not a chip. I really like this car. Lionel Racing. Got some sponsors back here. NASCAR off their next cool design. Number nine on the hood. And hashtag driven by Diecast. Camaro. So we shall move on. Kevin Harvick's number four, 2020 Jimmy John's car. Let's get this thing out of its box. I think it has a base on it. Does it have a base on it? Let's see. Oh, it does not. It does not have a base on it. Here we go. Number four, Stuart Haas Racing Ford Mustang. Yeah. If honestly, if it's not a, if it's not a Bush car. There's no need in putting Bush sponsors just, like, right here, right here. There's no need. So, for Reeky Fresh, Reeky Fast. Pretty cool car. It looks weird, though. The, why is the four down here? Shouldn't it be in the center? I don't know. Maybe it's like that in real life. But I don't really like this car. This little, I guess it's supposed to be a swoosh. Looks odd. Not a big fan of it. But it's cool. And I picked it up just to collect it. Who's next? I'm trying to go in number order. All right, we have Kyle Bush's number 18 Fudge Brownie M&M's 2020. All right, let's get this thing out of the package. This was the number one car I was looking for. So here we have it. Let's see. Oh my goodness. Here we go. Kyle Bush number 18 Toyota Camry. I really love that purple. That purple is just... I really do enjoy that. Mr. Red Eminem back here. Fudge Brownie, Kyle Busch, Joe Gibbs. Toyota Camry. In 2020, of course. So... Yep. Who we have next? Um, we'll do... We actually messed up. Ryan Blaney's number 12. Um, Kobe Bryant tribute that he ran at Auto Club. So... Let's go ahead and get this thing out of the package. Oh, yes. Holy crap. This is a beautiful, beautiful die cast. Wow. Body armor. You got some designs on the side. Penske Racing. Got the yellow fading into the purple. Really made it work. I don't know how. So, yeah. White rims look really Solid. 
of Team Penske 2020, Ryan Blaney, number 12, Ford Mustang. Who do we have? All right, we have William Byron's number 24. It's the other Cody Bryant tribute. So that's pretty cool to have both of the Kobe Bryant cars. I think there was only two, so this one actually costed a bit more. I'm not sure exactly why, but hey, we'll pack, unpackage it. Here we have it. Number 24, Exalta for Hendrick Motorsports. I like the purple. Just the all in all, pretty cool car. Um, let's see, is that a paint chip? I'm investigating. Yep, it's a paint chip right there on the T. Paint chip. I further investigated that paint chip. Um, there's a slight paint chip on the second A. I'm just the paint chip police. You're not going to be able to see it. But, pretty cool car. Up next. Man, Bubba Wallace, Black Lives Matter, he, the car that he ran at Martinsville. Dang, do I really like this car. Pretty cool to have, I think. So here we have it. The compassion, love, and understanding on the hood. Black, hashtag Black Lives Matter. Got the classic Richard Petty number 43 with the swoosh. Got some other sponsors. McDonald's, Alsto. Compassion, love, and understanding on the back. I mean, it's a pretty plain car. It's just a solid black, but it works. It works. All right, we have two more. Rush chest stains number 77. Advent Health Chevrolet. And he's the melon man. He is the melon man, so... This custom packaging is very interesting, I do say so myself. So, the Advent Help car, number 77. It's got the watermelon designs here, running across the bottom. 77, Advent Help. Uh, so, yeah, pretty cool car. Not much else to say. Got some cool designs on the back of it. But last... Last but certainly, certainly not least, we have Alex Bowman's number 88. Adam's Polishes, I guess, is on the hood. ChevyGoods.com. Let's go ahead and get this bad baby out of the package. You know, it sucks for Bowman. I think all these Chevy Goods are either non-sponsored or they're Rick Hendrick. And he probably would have put Hendrick cars on it. Some Adam's Polishes there. The hood and then weird looking design. <laughs> I feel like they could have done a better job with the paint scheme, let's be honest. But this is the only one I'm going to be getting. I don't really care about the hood sponsor changing. I don't know if they're going to produce any different ones with the hood sponsor, but I don't think that I'm really going to get any more than this one. So it is time for the grand finale. Bubble Wallace's 124 scale stock car. You can see it right there. Black Lives Matter car. Oh my goodness. This, this is, I don't know, but here we have it. I mean, I already reviewed this one, just at a smaller scale. So, the orange number on the hood and the roof is a bit interesting. Interesting choice there. Pretty cool car overall, I have to say. Back here. There we go. The front. There we go. Richard Petty, more sports. But, yeah. I don't really pick up 124s that often, I'm going to be honest. But I think this one was worth it. So these are all the cars. I was going to get a Chase Elliott truck, but um, I thought I got one, but apparently I didn't. <laughs> I think I accidentally put it back on the shelf. But I was going to get the bounty one you know with the Kyle Busch bounty like with the uh it, it was something back in like the beginning of the season after the COVID thing but I hope you guys enjoyed this one a like would always be appreciated and a subscribe would be nice hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one Good.